What's up, peers, and welcome to the World Crypto Network here on the very important question on how can you actually keep on stacking these sats? How can you accumulate more of this amazing, scarce, and sound monetary system? or well currency well uh, it's not as simple as it might look at first because right because most of the time uh, other peers would send you to a shit show like conbase and you log on to conbase you do like the picture of the id and everything and you have to completely get naked and and talk about like the the sexual nightmares of your mother and they want to know everything it's horrible so and and then right when you're through this entire know your customer aka their spying on you system then you're gonna see first and foremost like ripple and and like other shit coins like Ethereum. No, what the hell? No, I wanted to have sound money, not some stupid internet token. I actually want to have something that is sound and logical, not something that doesn't make sense whatsoever. Well, Pierce, the interesting question, how can you, pl- how can you buy Bitcoin only? Well, this awesome resource page has you covered. Right here, this is how you can get your hands on some precious, precious Satoshis. There are a couple of cool services listed here, and I would add one of my own that I can personally recommend. First of all, a really cool uh, system here by a, a good friend uh, is the Azteco. Redeem your Azteco Bitcoin voucher. And this is really, really awesome. Okay, This is developed by Beautyon, a cypherpunk and core Bitcoiner, one of the really good peers in our network. Basically, when you go to a, re- a regular supermarket, right, you can buy, for example, top-up credit for your phone. And you pay, let's say, $20 in cash. And at the registry, you get a 16-digit voucher. And usually, you would send an SMS or something with the 16 digits to your phone carrier. And then they would credit your, uh, in their centralized database, they would credit you with some additional uh, minutes or, or some, some other type that you've bought. Right? It's similar to PlayStation credits or whatnot. Well, this is the same concept, but with sound money Bitcoin. So you go to the store, you buy this voucher for, let's say, 50 bucks, and then you get a special 16 digits. And then you type these in right here, and you paste your Bitcoin address, uh, which is, of course, your own address with your own keys. You make sure that you are not a robot and not a dog, right? That's always tricky to find out. And then you redeem it. Voila, that's all you need to do in order to get your hands on a couple Bitcoin. And as soon uh, as they will send these Bitcoin to this uh, address provided by you, and as soon as you have one or two uh, confirmations, you will have your Bitcoin sound and secure. The only little risk here is that first and foremost, Azteco does not send you money, right? And thus it's important that you know the peers behind it, right? Uh, so find out about Azteco, find out about Bullion and, and check if he's actually trustworthy, right? Because there is some level of trust involved here. Also really nice is that you can easily become a vendor. So if you do have a physical store, here is a way of you being able, uh, right here you see this little, uh, little thing, awesome. Uh, this is a way how you can... Uh, sell a couple or how you can make revenue by helping others buy Bitcoin. This is awesome. And depending on the store, this means that there would not be any know your customer done. That is awesome. Next option, Fast Bitcoin. And that is cool as well. Uh, They have a similar Bitcoin also here with a redeem voucher. Uh, So you can buy on many different types of locations and you enter uh, the voucher number uh, and it will automatically get the voucher value Uh, You, unfortunately, will have to provide an email address. However, of course, this would mean that you can also do a Sock Puppet account. No question here. And then this is awesome. They both have standard on-chain transactions, but they also do have, and that is fantastic, Lightning Network payouts already. Uh, So this is really, really cool. You can now here then uh, provide them with a invoice to your own Lightning Network node, and you can easily receive your Lightning Network payments. I'm not certain if they can actually open a a Lightning Network payment channel to you. That would be cool, but I'm not certain how exactly that would be, uh, how that would work. As I think this only works uh, in Britain, but I'm not 100% certain. So with all these, right, make sure that you actually uh, check if these are available. And yeah, I mean, 6% fees, 
Uh, it's kind of a lot, but I mean, come on, it's doable. Uh, we also have right here the Cash App, uh, developed by a Square, uh, who is also the company somewhat involved with Twitter and, and some other things. So Cash is a useful app that allows you to accept fiat payments and then also credit cards and stuff like this as a merchant. And since recently, they also accept Bitcoin. So you can uh, buy Bitcoin on here with a couple of clicks and easily withdraw it to your own wallet. So the Cash App itself is custodial, uh, so be careful right here. Um, but it is a really intuitive interface, and this is Bitcoin only. So you're not going to find any shit coins other than the fiat shitcoin, which of course is the biggest shitcoin of them all. So hopefully Cash App will get rid of the fiat shitcoin uh, in total as well. Well, we don't know. Uh, but hopefully uh, what we do have then right here next is bull bitcoin it's canada's bitcoin or canada's bitcoin company and the really cool thing is here that bull bitcoin is the anti con base it's the anti bitpay this is a company by and for bitcoin enthusiasts uh, francis poliar here the the uh, creator of satoshi's portal uh, has collaborated and i forgot the name of the creator of bitcoin brains however uh, they all get together here and also they have bills so this is a great great uh, company that is not just about bitcoin maximalism right you will not find a shit coin again other than the fiat shit coin on here but that's a temporary measure they are true cypherpunks they value your privacy and they value your liberty so this is definitely a ethical service with entrepreneurs that do have a moral compass and that will not steal from you uh, and of course they do have skin in the game uh, their faces is publicly known right here on the company yes here dave bradley exactly i forgot his name uh, so both Francis and Dave, very, very reputable and very good peers in the network. Uh, and I know Francis uh, personally have met him once or twice. Uh, and he is one of the ethical open source entrepreneurs in this space that I am proud to call myself uh, a, a peer on his network. So I'm very proud to be standing shoulder on shoulder with these amazing peers because they actually know what they're doing and they have their heart at the right place and the skills as well. We also have, of course, Telecoin, which you as peers on the World Crypto Network know very well. Telecoin is a site where you can easily accept Bitcoin donations to your own Bitcoin wallet. So you provide your own Bitcoin public address in order that you can then uh, receive funds uh, that anyone can send you. Uh, so that is really, really awesome. And it's not just Bitcoin on chain. It is actually also Lightning Network payments. Uh, and the cool thing is you can link it with your Bitcoin, uh, with, sorry, with your Twitter account. So people will easily find you for your public donations. Uh, but remember, this is public, right? So donations are going to be uh, tricky and make sure that you then uh, clean these Bitcoin with the Wasabi wallet afterwards. Uh, you can set different fundraisers, right? For example, here, my Purism laptop, which I'm recording this video on, you Pierce funded 100% of at 3.7 no, wait, uh, 37, 38 million Satoshi sets awesome. And of course, also Lightning Network payments. Uh, that is fan fantastic. So a great way, especially for content creators or, or all other peers who accept public donations to accept Bitcoin payments as well. Um, that is outstanding. We also have here, and that is somewhat a controversial point of view, the BISC decentralized exchange. Why is it controversial? Well, first and foremost, it is the best place to buy Bitcoin with a fiat uh, transfer, bank transfer, wire transfer, SEPA transaction. Why? Because this is not a centralized custodial exchange. You are the exchange. You run the server. You are in full control of the entire open source protocol and you at all times and always control your own keys. That is outstanding. It does not require any KYC because friends don't spy on friends and friends don't let them friends be spied upon. So take care of your privacy and exchange in a way that is ethically righteous. You're not cattle. You're not the, the, the object of someone. You are a sovereign individual that has the right to be left alone and to do peaceful business with another friend and another peer on your network. And this is exactly that point of view. And you can, like I'm doing here, get rid of your fiat shit coins in the most ethical, in the most righteous way that you could ever do uh, with SEPA wire transfers. Uh, however, right, and that's of course here the main issue why BISC itself is not here on the Bitcoin dot, uh, slash only dot com is because there are a bunch of shit coins in here as well. Why? Because it's your server and it's open source software. And well, it's an exchange, so it's made 
to exchange shitcoins for Bitcoin. And well, the fiat is one of these biggest shitcoins and they just accept a bunch of other shitcoins. Well, I've made several in-depth videos about the BISC decentralized exchange on the World Crypto Network. And one thing that I showed you is how you can easily take off all the shitcoins that you don't need. Um, all the fiat shitcoins of currencies that you're not being forced to use, right? Of, of the slave masters from another country. And then also, though, all the digital cryptocurrency shitcoins that are much weaker than Bitcoin. Uh, so you can get rid of all the shitcoins uh, here in this exchange. And I personally do that. So for me, on my server, on my node, is Bitcoin only. And thus, I'm very much in favor of including BISC here in this awesome list because it absolutely deserves it. If Bitcoin has ended federal, the Federal Reserve and central banking, then BISC has ended Coinbase because no longer are you at the whim of some, some immoral and unethical company uh, started by Brian uh, Armstrong here, but you are actually in full control, not just of your keys, but even of the server. And that is outstanding. So I can only recommend using this exchange. It's the only exchange uh, that I would use because it is the only one that does not spy on you. And that is something that is of utmost importance. Know your customer is so goddamn evil and we need to stop it. We must stop it. And the BISC decentralized exchange is, in my opinion, the best chance that we have, the most profound tool that we can use in order to reclaim our privacy and liberty. Peers, keep on stacking them sats because they are quite precious things. And well, decrease your time preference, hodl your Bitcoin, think ahead of the future. Don't waste your money on cheap plastic crap that you don't need, but actually save your money, save your purchasing power so that you can build something delightful, something beautiful in the future. That is what sound money is all about. Pierce, thank you very much here for joining me again. And remember, bye-bye.